ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we're standing today. The vibes are immaculate. We're pumping energy drinks because I'm getting ready to work out after this, but we got time for a quickie, but a goodie. Roll the clip. I'm going to ask people on Facebook to pay my bill. Morgan Wallen. You have a, a knife up your Yes, I do. You want to come get it? No. I did have night. money. I have $7.5 million. Dollars. Okay. Guys, the truth is I'm damn near 40. All right. I can't be sitting for long hours or I'm going to get like a clot and my leg is going to shoot up into my brain and I'm just going to be screaming at a body cam and fucking face down into the desk onto the floor. I can't, I can't be doing that to the family. Think of the family guys. All right. You don't think it back on family. Let's get right into it. This one is about a woman who, um, well, there's pizza involved and a woman who's entitled. So right up our alley on April 4th, 2024, officers responded to a call regarding a woman refusing to pay for her pizza. Classic. Fuck awesome. Yeah. I'll take five pies, but also I have no money. What can you do for me? This is embarrassing already. Good. That's, did we get this figured out? No. Okay. Did, I need my boyfriend to um, pay my bill. And there, and what happened was my other phone, my phone doesn't have Wi-Fi in there. Let's take this outside. I'm sorry. Did she say, did she say boyfriends? As in S meaning plurality of men in her life? My boyfriends. What I wouldn't give to see these trophy boyfriends. Yeah. My dad did 44 years in NYPD. Okay. You can call him. That doesn't matter. Oh yeah, let me just, oh, your dad did 44 years in NYPD? Yeah, sure, let me just call him real quick. Uh, yeah, oh, sure, yeah. Good to see, I know, it's, how's retirement? Great, yeah, your daughter's here uh, at the pizza shop. She ordered a bunch of pizza and can't pay, and apparently her boyfriends, of which she has plural. You're joking. What, uh, can't pay for it, and for whatever reason, I mean, listen, if you have multiple boys in your life, can't one of them go down to the pizza shop and get the pies for you? What are we doing here, lady? Believe that shit. It does matter. I had money in my account okay, and now I him. don't. Clearly not. He's in charge here. Okay, I had money in my account and now I don't. Welcome okay. to the real world, bitch. <laughs> Relatable content, am I right? Okay. This right. happens to me all the time. My car broke down. You're, you're like, you can okay. see it. Well, you need to pay your bill. I know. I'm going to make money if I have my phone to make money. Well, you need to pay your bill now. Okay. What that's business we running? So you're not going to pay your bill? No, I'm going to pay my bill. If I have my phone, I Are can't Are you going to pay your bill it. right now? I'm going to try. Where's your phone? In the bar. Hang on, back. Probably in my bag, or sometimes it vanishes, because God just does that shit to me. Uh, either at the bar, it might, it's maybe in my bag, um, but occasionally God will actually just, just he'll hide it on me, because... The way I make money online, well, he's not too bummed about that. So he does the old Jesus prank, sends his only son, hides the phone. It's a whole thing. I don't want to get into it, but I just need it so I can make money to pay for this pizza. Makes sense. The, I'm confused. How are you going to pay your bill with your phone? <laughs> I'm going to ask people on Facebook to pay my bill. Morgan Wallen. <laughs> he does He does do that. What the fuck does this well, have to do with right. Morgan Wallen? Did she see Morgan Wallen like put up a... You know how people sometimes will put a QR code or they'll like put their Venmo up and be like, yeah, buy, buy people around. Is that what she's talking about? Does she think Morgan Wallen's going to pay for her pizza? Last night, we let the liquor talk. I ordered 15 pizzas and made my Facebook friends pay for it. I had money in my account. Are we going to pay the bill today? I want to. Not with. Do you? Asking Morgan Wallen. <laughs> okay. My dad. Uh, your dad means nothing to me. To be I, completely honest, he means nothing. I know, NYPD cops hate you guys too. That's fine. I, it doesn't matter that he's NYPD or not. Your dad is not anywhere. My mom can pay my bill. If we, I went to her house to try to get it. Okay, is your mom willing to come here and pay your bill right now? Yes, if you call her. Okay. If you call her, she's not gonna believe me. She thinks I'm a psycho. <laughs> <sighs> Officer, I'm gonna be honest with you. My mom would pay the bill, because it's kind of, let's be honest, it's a little embarrassing, but if I call her and ask for money for pizza and tell her that I'm about to get arrested for not paying for the pizza, she's not She's not going to believe me. To be honest, she thinks I'm kind of a psycho. I know that sounds crazy because I'm very, I'm very well adjusted and cogent, as you can tell by everything I've said so far. But if you could just call her and get her to pay for the pizza, I think that would be great. We could just <laughs> spick and span, go our separate ways. No problemo. I mean, listen, if mom thinks you're crazy. She's stealing my kids from me. We can trauma bond all day long, but we're not going to do that. 
Okay. Is this your vehicle? Yes. Okay. All right. Are you a registered owner of the vehicle? Yes, I am. You don't have anything inside this vehicle to pay your bill. No, I have $7 on you to pay my bill. Pop at 315 St. John's. Boyfriend to come and pay it for me. He will do that, but I need a phone to do that. Just go get your phone. What are we waiting on? What are these pizza shop owners going to say? What's your bill? Uh, go ahead. I can print it. I'm sorry? I can print it. Okay. Cool. Yeah. She's sitting here trying to come up with all that stuff yeah. about how she wants to try to get them. Yeah, so we're not winning. Well, she wanted to offer that. Yeah. She didn't have a car that she could find. Yeah, she, she, she walked here. Like, she walked in here with no car. And then she <laughs> drove off in that marine car. So it must, someone had to drop, like, I was like, either she's a magician, <laughs> she's a movie star that's just trying to cause trouble for, oh, for two. Like, I don't know what. If she's a movie star, then I am a Mickey Mouse stunt double. I'm not thinking, that's not, nope. No, we're not doing that. Larry, who's Larry? Larry, my ex-boyfriend. All my ex-boyfriends are friends of mine. They'll pay my bill, they, they have jobs. Man, can you just let the woman post a Facebook already? Hello, Officer Morgan Wallen, buddy. The free pizza, you know how it goes. Ex-boyfriends, Facebook, Morgan Wallen, just give me my phone, Jesus Christ. But I need my phone to work. Don't we all? To call them, and my phone is dead. To I call. can go to my house and charge it. Love that, I love the way that New Yorkers say call. To call them, the water. I gotta call them to get some water so I can pay for my pizza. I can't do it very well, I just love the call. Uh, do you guys want to press charges? Uh, she can't pay her bill. Yeah. I can walk there and leave walk. my car here and my bag here. Okay. You leave your bag here? You stay here often? I, I'm a where, squatter. Okay. All right. Where is your residence? Did you say she's a squatter? You stay here often? I, I'm where, a squatter. Okay. All right. Where is your residence right now? Right there. 130. Which car did you come here? In, in the red car. Just going to use it. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. And you said you're not going to pay this? No, I am going to pay it tomorrow. Okay. Well, yep. that's going to help me. All right. Oh man! I mean, if you, what are you ordering fifty? What are you ordering fifty something dollars worth of pizza for, anyways? If you buy yourself, that's a pretty big afternoon snack. If I'm being honest, I mean, you know, maybe it's closer to dinner time. In her defense, hungry gal, bro, that is tough to get back. You, like you do. You're going to jail right now for defrauding an innkeeper. I did it before. Defrauding an innkeeper? That's amazing. That sounds so. That sounds so. Um, that sounds so mystical. Like very. It sounds very like Final Fantasy esque. Like an innkeeper. When was that law written? I wonder. Defrauding an innkeeper. Is that from fucking Chrono Trigger? You're failing to pay your bill. I'm not failing to pay my bill. I need my bag so I can make some phone calls. And my pizza and my meal. No, you're not taking that. Hipper. They don't take food in jail. Oh, I have right bread and right? Daniel Rowe. Right. You already did. Oh. Now I'm not going to get my kids 26, back. thank you. That might be for the best, to be honest. Oh, the poor kids. Do you have anything on you that's going to go yes, into the I have a knife. St. John's. What? Okay. This whole time, why, like, just let her get her phone. Let her show you, like, what she's planning on doing on Facebook. You know? Let her write up a nice little post. Give her, like, 10, 15 minutes to craft up something nice. A little sob story. I mean, you can e begging on Facebook probably does work. If I'm being honest, like just put up a little Venmo QR code. Like guys, I or I don't send it to her. All her ex boyfriends or her current boyfriends about to get bagged. Cuffs are coming on. I just need like fifty bucks for pizza. Come on, I'll get you guys back. I'll catch you on the next one, the first of the month. You should get my bag so no, I can call my dad. If you give me my bill. Oh, yeah. She's gonna be 10 15 left from Or my right mom. I'm not a defrauder. This shit happens to me all the time. Why? Why? Do, why? How are you all the time just ordering pizza and not paying for it? I'm confused. It's just a common occurrence. You're all your so, friends know me. I feel bad for her, to be honest, but like. So you said you have a, a knife up your. Yes, I do. You wanna come get it? No. So it's not in her bag. She has a knife. Wait, did they blank that out? Did she have a... A knife up your... Yes, I... Does she... <laughs> Whoa. Hold. Hold the phone! Does she have a knife in her pussy? <laughs> Is that what I just heard him say? 
You sh is she carrying a knife inside of her right now? You do. You want to come get it? No. I, I didn't think so, to. asshole. Okay. I double dog dare you. Come on, do it. From one pussy to the other, go grab it. Well, Missed opportunity, quite well, frankly. Good, thanks. So you know, appreciate it. Holy cow! Yeah, there's some more roadie for you. No, well, there's a bunch in here. Did she buy that one from you guys? Well, yes, she bought well, it. Well, yeah. Us. yeah. <laughs> and then she brought these. Yeah, those were in there. No bad. Yeah, okay. Gotcha. Thanks. She's good. She's good. like bringing in Heineken cans. Unsurprising that there's some sort of substance involved here, obviously. Yeah, not a problem, guys. Y'all have a good one. I want to come back. I appreciate you. No, for real. Cool. Thank you. We were just, as we pulled up, where he, he said, he's in training, he said, have you been here? I said, no, not yet. I need to come check it out. Well, so. if, you guys, if you guys have a break a little bit later, your pizza's on me, okay? Cool. <laughs> you can just have the pizza she just ordered and can't pay for. <laughs> <laughs> what the? That's funny. Is there a female deputy that can be 51 to us by chance? She's saying she has a signal zero in a inappropriate place. Ah, uh, she did. She's got a signal zero in an inappropriate place. I imagine that's police talk for she's got a knife in her pussy. <laughs> I think that's what that is. It's kind of like a 10-4 received 5-0 signal zero in an inappropriate place. Just a just a whole ass. I have to imagine, I hope, well, I mean, listen, I hope it's a jackknife or a switchblade or a butterfly knife. What if it was, that was just like a kitchen knife? I could get problematic. <laughs> She's on this side. Um, her name is Danielle. Hi, Danielle. Hi, how are you? Should you, oh, you look so pretty. Thanks. Wait, dead ass. Is she going to go? Is she, the moment of truth. She's got the glove on. She's ready to fish it out. I'm beside myself. You know, I was going to my boyfriend's house, but he I didn't want to shop. pretty to go to a... Well, I, I was at the pub waiting for him to come get me. Real quick. Come on out, Fred. You said you got some up there? No, I don't. I was kidding. Oh! Okay. Not well, something to joke about. I gotta kind of check. I'm really? Not gonna, yeah, not gonna, yeah, I'm not gonna do a whole... Um, I was hey, before she does that, let me ask you. I just talked to your mom on the phone, and she said that you didn't pay your bill at some bar last night. No, because this happens to me all the time. Well, if you didn't... <laughs> She's acting like it's this random thing she has no control over. She's like, I officer, I have no fucking clue. I just continue. Every time I go somewhere, I just order drinks or food. And for whatever reason, there's not enough money in my account to pay it. I have no idea what's going on, but it just keeps happening. It's insane. I don't know what the fuck to do. Well, I have a fucking great starting plan for you. And that is to stop going out to restaurants and bars and ordering food when there's no money in your account. There's, there's other ways to give yourself sustenance. Clearly, you have ways of feeding yourself, if I'm judging, uh, by your, your visual performance here, but- You didn't pay your bill at some bar I, last night. I love it. No, because this happens to me all the time. Well, if you did- Like, that's so, like the way she's acting, she's acting like it's this, this um, thing that's outside of her control. It's like, yeah, I know. I sprained my ankle again, walking down the stairs. It just it happens to me all the time. I just, God, I'm so unlucky. What are you talking about? Didn't have money. I did have night. money. I have $7.5 million. Uh, okay. right. Do you know? Right. He's, just, he has he's being an asshole. No, he's asking you a question. This is my wrong. dad did 44. All right. He's just, he has he's asked being an asshole. Hold on no, a second. Million dollars okay. all the time. Well, if you didn't have money, I did have night, money. I have $7.5 million dollars 7.5 mil and a knife in your cooch you are good to go young buck let's fucking go what are you doing in the back of a cop car you should be boss mode right now all right he's just he asked he's being an asshole no he's asking you a question this is my dad did 44 years in the nypd congratulations i did 20 years in the nypd okay nah i'm gonna call i'm throwing the red flag on that one bullshit prove it not a fucking chance you did if you did it <sighs> You sure it wasn't 20 years on the Secret Service? <laughs> I'm sorry, too soon. So, I'm retired. No, you're not. Do you have anything up your hoo-ha? <laughs> this guy's like, bullshit. No, you're not. Love it. No. God, I don't want to look. I know. I, 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 I don't. I'm I gonna, don't. I'm going to check I, it. Just I can't, take I, a peek. I, I, Just at least do a pat down. What about? I, I, I can't. Thing, because my legs are 
and stuff because they're chubby. You're athletic. You're not chubby. And don't call us chubby, woman. <sighs> Hold on a second. I need to hear this exchange again. It's not because they're chubby. You're athletic. You're not chubby. And don't call us chubby, woman. I mean, I love the, the girl power there. You're not chubby. You're athletic. Don't call us chubby, sweetheart. She's so nice to her. Like, I love that. This is nice. Like, you know, this woman clearly is a little bit, you know, a couple of cans short of a six pack for whatever reason. 7.5 million, no way to access it. Keeps, I don't know why this keeps happening. She just keeps ordering things from restaurants and bars, can't pay it. It's outside of her control, poor thing. I need my bag. I need, go ahead, we're gonna get it, but go ahead. Thank you. All right. Very nice Hang tight for me, okay? Thank you. Charged with defrauding Thanks. an innkeeper. She's retired, and now she's arrested for defrauding an innkeeper. I imagine, like, there's no way you get processed and tried. I have no idea, but maybe you have to go to a court date and they're like, oh yeah, there's a little fine you gotta pay for being an idiot. Most likely just a slap on the wrist of some sort, unless she's some sort of repeat offender, which according to this video sounds like uh, she was in the process of becoming. So many oddities with this woman. I mean, where do you begin? The repeat behavior, acting like she has no control over it. The defaulting to saying when asked if she has anything, any weapons on her, she's like, yeah, I got a knife in my cooch. That's a weird place to go. Actually, in hindsight, maybe she's just like getting a little bit, she's getting a little bit dry and she's like looking for a little bit of action. She's like, well, if I tell him I have a knife in my cooch, he's going to have to reach down there and maybe hit the bean by accident. And then they're like, well, obviously we can't do that. So they called the female officer and she got there and she's like, I was kidding, fuck. What do I gotta do to get a little peace around here? Jesus. Her imaginary Facebook friends can pay her bail now. <laughs> I had money in my account and now I don't. Join the club, lady. <laughs> That's what I was saying in the beginning, dude. So funny, welcome to life. Don't you just hate it when God takes your cell phone? <laughs> oh man. Sometimes I leave it at home. Sometimes it's in my bag. Occasionally I leave it in the bathroom and every once in a while God comes down snatches it right out of my hand to teach me a lesson. Say your Hail Marys, ladies and gentlemen. I think ordering and eating $53 worth of pizza in one sitting alone is the most insane thing going on here. I, that is pretty insane, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna veto that and say that's maybe the sec, that's second or third in line from what I just saw. Defrauding an innkeeper sounds like a charge you would catch in the 1600s. That's what I'm saying. How, this was definitely written around the time the constitution was made for sure i'm gonna go ahead and pour one out for this woman's kids and send one up to jesus to hope that they can live a somewhat normal life having a mother like this all this defrauding and innkeeper talk has got me wanting to play Baldur's gate so i'm gonna go log in i'll see you guys in the next video thanks for watching make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't and hip thrust that motherfucking like button i appreciate it. we'll see you in the next video peace